How is everybody doing today? Hope you all have a wonderful view like this. Hey, I had a couple um, viewers ask for a video showing the basic navigation of the Vision Pro OS and really focusing on the overall snappiness and kind of fluidity of the operating system. So in this video, I'm gonna go over some of the basic navigation functions and then also some of the voice commands as well. So to start my main menu, I go ahead and hold my hand out and go ahead and pinch. And this will bring up my app um, really menu. I have my apps, I have my contacts, and then I have my environments over on the corner. For this example, we are only using native Vision Pro apps. We are not connected to our MacBook. Um, we are only using apps running on the Vision Pro. So let's go ahead and open up Safari. In Safari, it looks like we're going to start with YouTube. Let's actually start with Apple. As always, we can make the screen larger if we wanted to. And using our fingers, pinching to navigate through the screen. Uh, let's say we want to open up another tab. So let's go ahead and open up YouTube. You'll see right now we have two different tabs going on. We have the YouTube and the Apple. You'll notice right now I am looking at the YouTube menu. When I look at the Apple, you could see the menu kind of change and highlight. That's how you're doing your navigation. So right now I'm on YouTube, and if I want to flip over to the Apple tab, I look at it. You'll see the menu change, YouTube, Apple. And then we go ahead and pinch our fingers, and now we are on the Apple screen. Once again, if I wanted to go to the YouTube one, I would look at it. You can see the menu change, kind of highlight, and then pinch my fingers to select that. Now, what if there was an instance where you just wanted to have two different windows open? Um, in that case, we would actually look at the YouTube one, pinch our fingers, and then pull it away from the screen. And now it is going to open up another window for us. Um, we could go ahead and do that again. Let's go ahead and open up another tab. Let's do uh, the Weather Channel. Now we have two tabs open, Apple, Weather, Apple, and Weather. Um, this time, let's go ahead and pull the Apple tab out and create a new window. So we are going to look at our Apple menu, pinch, and then pull that window out, and then let go. And now you can see we have two windows. And the it really is limitless as far as the amount of windows that you want to have. Um, but with Safari, I seem to find two or three of them kind of perfect. Now, what if you wanted to kind of blend the apps together, right? So you want to have Safari running, and you also want to have some native um, Vision Pro apps running as well. Well, we'll go ahead and hold our fingers, tap, open up our, let's open up our music. We won't play anything so we don't get copyrighted, but we could put our music app over here. And now you could see the fluidity of it. We have an Apple tab, which we could look at, interact with. We can instantly look at this weather one and interact as well. Go ahead and close these, interact with it well. I'm just changing the way I'm looking. And then we could go over to the native Vision Pro Music app and also interact with that as well. Um, one of the other questions we had was voice commands. You could do things like, hey Siri. And Siri took a screenshot for me that I could save. Um, you could also do full voice. So let's go ahead and open up our notes tab. And let's just put our notes down here. Let's go ahead and do a new note. And we are in here right now. And we will do voice. So let's go. So that's a quick example of the voice dictation that's on it. Let's try to have um, the voice open up an app. Let's go ahead and do, uh, let's try Keynote. Let's go, let's close this and let's try this. Hey Siri. And now you can see Siri went ahead and opened up our um, Keynote just by using the voice command. 
Um, so the number one thing I say about uh, Vision OS, specifically 2.2, is what we're on right now, is it's fluid. I mean, just the way you can move stuff around um, and interact with it just by looking at it. Like I said, we're changing our head to kind of look at different tabs, or different windows. But if we have two tabs on the same window, we literally just change our eyes, right? We change where we're looking, and it highlights different aspects of the screen. For example, looking at this weather app right now, if I wanted to look at the share, if I wanted to look at the add new tab or the show tab overview, I am not moving my head at all. All I am doing is moving my eyes in where I am looking. And then if I wanted to take any of those actions, I would just pinch my fingers together. Um, it really is fluid, really is um, a joy to work in. So hopefully that helped you guys, at least with some of the basic navigation. The other thing with the basic hand commands, like I said, one pinch to bring up the menu, two pinches to close it. If you turn your hand over and pinch, now you bring up your volume commands and um, battery percentage and a clock in your volume sound. Menu, volume. Other than that, let me know if you guys have any specific um, applications you'd like to see. Have a great day.